Well then, guys, before I actually show you the inside of this, there's a key there, which basically, so you can turn it on or off. This does your, your KV, how much KV you want to give out. This does how much milliamps you want to give the X-ray output. Uh, this is the voltage in. This is a green light to show when the unit's on, I presume. This is to turn it off, to stop the x-rays or whatever. <gasps> Excuse me. This is the thickness of the steel you're working with. Okay. This is the time. Sorry. This is the time, I presume, of how many minutes you want it to run for. There's a counter just down there which tells you how long the unit's been run for. And it's 85 hours. <clears throat> very very nice piece of equipment so you want to show you around the other side of course you do now let's me use me use my phone for uh, the light shall we Very, very nice equipment. There's actually valves in this, which is just there, look. in those silver capsules. There's a load of valves, some 10 turn potentiometers, some capacitors, and the star one. Let me turn this, let me get this over a bit, and look at the size of that variac. That variac just there, hold on. That variac just there has got some wheels on it. So if I turn this particular wheel, which is the milliamps, it turns the wheels just there. Oh, come on, your stupid camera. There we go. Turns there. And then the other side. Is the voltage just look at that wheel it's an absolutely fantastic bit of kit really really is there's nice micro switch just there when the wheel goes around to the minimum There's a lot of resistors. There really is. Wish I wish there was. Wish I could show you. Sorry about the screen turning around on its own. It's pretty annoying. But yeah, there's uh, certainly a lot of gubbins inside of this unit. Very, very well put together. Very well put together indeed. So there's the wires there that come in <clears throat> from those points, the connectors. Unbelievable. I cannot thank this man enough for sending me this. Very, very nice of him indeed. At the end of the, game, at the, end of the day, you know, the chap could have made himself a bit of money by selling it on eBay. But, uh, you know, he, he, he chose to, to send me it as a gift with the Transformer. Which uh, I'm indebted to him. Thank you very much for going out your way to do that. It's very, very kind of you. And I look after this. I will. Yeah, there's the valves and uh, a few potentiometers there. Makes me 
foam frick. Is there anything about this uh, this Samsung pad? There's no bloody light on it for the camera, which is anything that lets it down really. That Variac, I've never seen anything like it. I really haven't. So guys, hope you've enjoyed the video. Um, you show me a lovely transformer, 150 kV, 100 to 150 kV. Uh, I think it's 400 volts input. So 250 volts will be nothing really. Do a video of this sometime of it uh, working. So I'm not uh, I'm not going to put this one on oil. I'm having this as a as um, one to put on my shelf because I've got enough X-ray transformers. But I wanted this one because I've not got one of this sort, and uh, I'm just going to have this powered up to a maximum of 40 volts so I can just get an output from it. But this one will be for the shelf. So thanks for watching, guys. Look after yourselves. Be safe. We'll speak again.